climbing has been something that largely I did by myself, with my friends and with people that I spent a lot of time with. Through that, um, it's always been something really great. Um, in terms of like, community's always been a big aspect of what I do. So you have your LabQuest Mini, you have the Colorimeter. That's been kind of subjugated to just teaching science. We're only measuring one wavelength and ocean. Let's go, Mareku! I really enjoy working with the kids. I love coaching track meets. If it's a JV meet or a varsity meet, I just love helping the kids improve and seeing their progression. It's so much fun. That looks pretty good. And so, kind of through this process of me joining the Full Circle Expedition, it was like, I have talents outside of just those two things, and I have talents that um, I should probably share with the, kind of the wider community. Can we give him a giant round of applause, my friends? Oh my goodness, there's so many kids. When you look at climbing, once there's good weather, we'll try our best to make it to the top and come back home safely. When you look at mountaineering, it is a largely primarily white sport. You don't see very many people of color, be it Latino, African American, Native American. You just don't see a lot of that representation out there. This is gonna be the first black team to ever climb the mountain. I'm not doing anything different by going and climbing this Everest expedition, but I think what's a little bit different on this expedition is that I'm sharing these stories and we're talking to kids and we're getting them excited and we're like purposely showing that like I can go to a place like that maybe you can go to a place like that if I can set up a big goal maybe you can set up a big goal awesome you can follow your dreams to do what you want to and no one can stop you from doing that I think that's one of those things that I just want to share is like you know I got in, I got into these things and one way or another, and I think that, you know, I want to just make sure that there's a path or they feel like this is something that they can do. And it's been great chatting with everyone. We've got a big Centaurus tradition every homecoming, every state championship. We have our band walk through the halls and play our fight songs. So today we're actually going to have our band go through, pick up Eddie, because this is going to be his last period before he heads to Everest, and walk him out of the building and give him a good send off Centaurus style. Huge for Centaurus. We're so proud of Eddie. We're so excited for him, and just uh, it's great to have one of our own going on such a big trip. Thank you, guys. And I think the more people see more diverse people doing these type of things in the outdoors, in front of them in the classroom, um, even if it's just any profession, really, I think it's very powerful for kids.